Hey, SCT crew. Hey. 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 hey, this is Greg Felicia Riley and Braylon. We are headed out on a post-pandemic, post-quarantine Memorial Day weekend trip. And mountain trip. Mountain trip. So we are going to vlog it. We're going to see what's open, what's closed, what's available. We have no idea what we're getting ourselves into, but we're headed out early on Friday morning and we're going to see what's available. We're going to take you guys along with us. Uh, this could be fun. This could be gnashing of teeth. We have no idea what we're in for, but y'all ride with us. Look how enthused those two are over there. You have never seen some. I don't know if it's because they got up early. I have no idea what this is. Early this is going to be. This is going to be fun, and she's going to kill me for this. But there's Carrie, y'all. Hey. So anyway, <laughs> hey guys, we're out of here. We're going to take you with us. We're going to ride north. We'll let y'all know how it goes along the way. Y'all say. Peace out. Bye. Bye. So we are here at our absolute favorite place to get sausage from. The jalapeno cheddar sausage from Striplings is our favorite. The jalapeno cheddar smoked sausage. We've tried the fresh and it's pretty good, but it's not as good as the smoked sausage. We are at Striplings, as you can see, if I pan this around, maybe even catch, it, catch that there. But we are here at the one in Perry. They got, they got quite a few of these um, scattered around South Georgia, but this is the one in Perry. Y'all gotta look at the camera. This is the camera. Focus on the camera. So anyway, we're at we're the point in Perry, Georgia. We took some footage of it. You guys got to stop by. This is right off I-75. If you ever, if you've ever been to the, um, the the Georgia National Fair, is that what it is here in Perry? Perry. It's right across from the fairgrounds, kind of off the interstate a little bit. Stop in, get you some sausage, check it out. But this is our, one of our first stops of the day. We'll see you guys soon. All right.
Hi. Are you excited? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> well, so so we have that intro music. Oh my god, just told me. <laughs> Hello. This is exactly how organized we are on this trip. Where are we at? Where are we at? We're in Marietta at the. Where's that? At the Rev. You pronounce it. Reveille. We're at the Reveille Cafe, where we had lunch with them, who who won't be on here today for some reason. Mark, Kathy, and Faith, and it was good. Did y'all say think it was good? It was very good. Very good. We're good. Cinnamon roll. See, right now you had a. Cinnamon roll. Cinnamon she roll. had she had a cinnamon roll, which you'll see that here, right here, just here. It's gonna be right here somewhere. And Riley had a breakfast parfait. Well, here yeah, you just <laughs> you just explained. Thirty-nine more dollars, Richard. Here's Faith. Faith, come here, Faith. Oh, hi. Faith, Faith, tell everybody what we had today. We had Reveille, which is where I work, oh, and it's much phenomenal food. We had pancakes, sandwiches, French toast. Bacon, omelet, anything you want, and we got turkey Dijon or turkey Dijon sandwich with honey Dijon sauce that she really enjoyed. So, yeah. so if you come to Marietta, come to Reveille and see Faith. <laughs> see Faith. Hey guys, it was awesome, and we'll see you further down the road. All right. What do y'all say? Bye. So this is the end of day one. It's been a long day. Just about 11 hours. 11 hours? No, it was longer than that. <laughs> I have no idea where the kids are. You think they're in the pool? Yes, they're oh. they're ramen. Did they change into swimsuits before they went down? Yeah. I don't know, the kids could be in the pool for all we know. We don't have any idea. Hopefully, they're, they're fine, they're safe. They're... Hopefully they'll come back before we go to bed, maybe. But anyway, it was a good day. They'll come back because we had their phone chargers. That's true. <laughs> Once the phones die, they'll come back. But anyway, we had a good day. So we let's 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 um summarize the day. So we left out. We um we stopped by Striplings. We got some. We got to go in there. We um. Hey, I know we talked about the sausage earlier, but I highly recommend the uh, chocolate covered peanuts. peanuts. However, let's just say <laughs> um don't leave the chocolate covered nuts in a hot vehicle. Hours. They become instead of little chocolate covered peanuts, <laughs> they become a chocolate bar. Um, and then we stopped off in Marietta, Georgia, and um, had lunch with Mark and Kathy and and Faith. But something else we got to see too that I've never seen before in my life. Um, Vice President Pence was in Atlanta, flew in, and Mark had told me that he was just to be watching as we came up I seventy five that. Vice President Pence was going to be flying in about 11 a.m. And so we noticed as we got towards Atlanta that southbound I-75 was a ghost town. Northbound 75 was as busy as it ever is, and uh, southbound was closed. There was, there was not a vehicle in sight for miles. And then sure enough, I've never seen a presidential motorcade or a vice presidential motorcade, but sure enough, here they came, and it was, it was a cool sight to see. So that was something interesting. The kiddos got to see a... Vice Presidential Motorcade, the the sad indictment on our school systems, though. They didn't uh, know who that is. They had no idea who the Vice President Much less what he Pence was. was. Yeah, so we had to explain that to them. But anyway, that was kind of cool. And then uh, we made a few pit stops because um, one of the kids decided to drink five, six, seven, eight glasses <laughs> of sweet tea at lunch. Because so, the nice waitress kept bringing them to me. Yeah, her. That, was, that was what she said. <laughs> I had to drink them, she kept bringing them to me, so made sense to me so we after we made a couple of stops it was a good time so we pulled into pigeon forge tonight about 6 30 and let me tell you most there's a lot of things that are open um for the most part it's business as usual 
with the exception of a lot of your fast food restaurants and places like that, you can't go in and sit down and eat. So we had to, we just wanted something quick tonight, and um, so we ran through a fast food restaurant, brought it back to the hotel, sat down in the lobby, ate it. I will tell you this, that there is no shortage of people at the good old-fashioned Walmart. <laughs> Walmart's as busy as it ever is. So It was like Black Friday. Yep. So this is the end of day one. We've had a blast sharing it with you. Um, stay tuned because tomorrow is a whole new day, a whole new adventure. A busy day. A busy day. Busy so we're going to have fun. So we will see you again tomorrow. So look for that. Goodbye.